My name is George Goulis, speaking on behalf of Universal Wrestling, the Major League of Pro Wrestling. We'll get back with more wrestling action, but first, I have in the studio another my father, promoter Nick Goulis. And right now, I've talked to him for a couple of minutes, and I know a lot of wrestling fans have asked the past several years, five to be exact, what has happened to you? Well, you've been out of wrestling since the latter part of 1979, and now it's 1986, a brand new year, and you're coming back into the area again. You'll be promoting Nashville, Murfreesboro, all the Middle Tennessee area and Southern Kentucky. I know a lot of wrestling fans have asked about you. They've stopped me and asked me, and I know they've asked a lot of wrestlers, but here you are here on Television 39. You can tell the wrestling fans you're healthy now. You had a bout of pneumonia, but you suffered back around Christmas in the first of the year, and of course, You've defeated that. I guess that was the biggest match of your career, not being a wrestler in the ring. But you've got a lot to say to the wrestling fans. A lot of talents coming in here. New York Doll, Bill Smithson, Terry Donis, manager Richard Lee, Tommy Higgy back in the area. you got Rough House Tommy King, the Samoans from WWF in Madison Square Garden. They're coming back. Plus, we also got the Mass Scorpions. We got Austin Idol, Joe LaDuke. That's, we don't have enough time to announce what's coming in this area. And I know you're glad to be back in the wrestling area, and of course, being your home here in Nashville, you're glad to be back. George, uh, many years I've been in the wrestling business. I, in fact, I was in it for 47 years, and I tried to bring the best wrestlers in the world right here in Nashville, in every place that I promoted. And I broke in a lot of fellas. A lot of the fellas that are wrestling today, I would say 75% of the wrestlers in the business today, I broke them in wrestling years ago, some of them 30 years ago, some of them 35 years ago. I had the greatest wrestlers in the world come to Nashville, such great stars as Jimmy Lunders way back in the early 30s and 40s and 50s, and the Ed Stranger Lewis, Luthez, Harley Race, Pat O'Connor, some of the greatest wrestlers in the world came to Nashville. I brought them here, and I intend to bring some of the greatest wrestlers back to Nashville, Murfreesboro, Birmingham, Chattanooga, Knoxville, Memphis, Louisville, Evansville, every town that I can open up and get back which I had at one time, I'm going to promote and bring back some of the greatest wrestlers in the world. I know one thing a lot of wrestlers have said, they're coming back when Nick Goulas comes back. I guess you're just like a kitchen in the household word. You know, you can say that some names like Joe Nemphis, the football, and Bob Cousy, the basketball, and Mickey Mountain, the baseball, your names are associated with pro wrestling, and that's why they're waiting for you to come back, because they know you can bring in the best. And since you have mentioned about coming back and then back in this area, you've been flooded with phone calls. I tell you what, I'm sure you can tell wrestlers and wrestling fans, you're not going to stop now. You'll probably get a lot more calls of what you've got, and a lot of fans are glad you're back in it. So I know Universal Wrestling is glad to have you in it. I know that you've missed it for five long years, but I tell you what, five years has gone by very quick knowing you're back in the wrestling world again. I know the wrestling fans are glad you're in it, and so are the pro wrestlers. Well, I'm glad to get back, Jordan. I'm glad to get back here in Nashville. We're going to either have the matches at the fairgrounds or the city auditorium in downtown Nashville. We'll let you know in the next couple of weeks when we'll have the match, the first match, and also where we could be located. And we'll get back with more Universal Wrestling, the Major League of Pro Wrestling. But first words from our spots, been back with more wrestling from Universal Wrestling. Five pounds from Lebanon, Tennessee. Here's Peaches. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. The spoiler now going right in after Peaches. Spoiler going right in after Peaches. Peaches, one of the new Black Mad stars. He's a big man, too, and you don't rile this man picking up the spoiler. He's just street fighting in there. Peaches going right in after the spoiler. Spoiler whip. Peaches waiting on him to come off. Picks him up. Back body drop. Well, that's one way of doing it. Peaches just an old street fighter in that ring, I tell you. Decked out in his blue jeans and his T-shirt and his tennis shoes and just going to work on the spoilers. He's going to wrap him up real quick. I knew the spoiler was in trouble when he tried to attack you before you got into the ring, big man. Congratulations hey, on your victory. Thank you. Thank you. Promoter George Nicholas, did you see that? He just took took the match right to him. Well, you know one thing. The spoiler said he's really a tough man. Well, the wrestling fans in this area know what the spoiler can do. He can't do much of anything. He was beaten last week, and he was demoralized today. So if the spoiler thinks that he's a top man, he was beaten twice in two weeks, and Peach has made fine effort him in about what 50 seconds I think it was less than that I think about 40 seconds he demolished the man but he just went in there and took it 
took it right to him. Now, that was, it, it, this is basically your style. Just get in there and street fight. That's it. If that's what they want, that's what they get. I want to serve notice today, starting today, with the spoiler. If this is what they want, this is what they'll get. All right, strong well, words. You know, we thought the spoiler was that tough, but he's been resting in the mid-state area. But Pete has made, uh, I guess, Pete's pie out of him because he sure didn't last long. And I guess the spoiler, this has a name, but he sure couldn't wrestle against the spoiler here today. Absolutely right. I'll tell you, the fans reacted right there to Peaches, too. I'll tell you, the man took it right to him and took the match. One, two, three. That was real quick. I, I guess we'll go to a break here and then, then go to the and uh, uh, welcome them in to Universal Championship Wrestling. Can everybody see us? Everybody wave to the camera real quick so they'll see you on TV one time. There's a gentleman back up here I've been, uh, been watching here in the matches. Hi, sir. What's your name? Clayton Higginbotham. Clayton, welcome. Welcome to the wrestling matches. You enjoy wrestling? I enjoy it a whole lot. I, I'd love to see some of the changes made, though. Some of the referees can't see some of this dirty stuff like... Bounty hunters putting out, stomping a man in the neck and all that, and these beautiful things from Alabama, whatever they are, coming up here throwing people over the rope. You know, a few things like that could be changed. I agree with you. I agree with you. I know one thing. We're going to show that tape of that fire being thrown. We're going to show that to the commission. I can guarantee you that. That ought to be illegal in anybody's book. Absolutely. Absolutely. Well, it's fine to have you here, sir. A great wrestling fan. Glad to have you with us. Very good. There's a young lady over here. I know a little bit about this young lady. I've been told by uh, one of the basketball referees in this area that this young lady plays for Maplewood High School for the uh, girls' basketball team. Is that true? Yes, it is. What's your name? Terry Kirby. All right, Terry, what position do you play? I'm guard. Guard? Do you foul out a lot, Terry? No. Or the referees just watch you real close? See, I now she's complaining the referees watching her too close. That's, we got to straighten that out, don't they we? just watch a little bit too close. Are uh, you returning next year for another year of basketball? Be my last year. Very good. Well, best of luck to you. Hope you win a lot of games. Thank you. All right, very good. Let's see who else. <laughs> Promoter George Nick Goulas, who is a basketball referee for the Tennessee State Athletic Commission. Uh, 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 athletic, TSSAA, right, George? Yes, yes, yes. Does a very good job, too. Says he'll, he'll watch her real close. All right, very good.